This is a blend extra. Well, think for a moment about your family recipes. Maybe one that you got from your mom, maybe your grandma. Well, today we are talking about a recipe that's been around for 130 years. That is a long time. Yep. Chef Kate Luloff <laughs> is here from Jones Dairy Farm, where they have been using that same sausage recipe for six generations Long now. time. Incredible. Hey, Kate. Isn't that cool? How are you guys doing? Yeah, right. it's, it's cool. I mean, it's kind of a, a, a fun thing for a company to say, but it's also delicious. It is. And it's the same, like you said, same recipe. Um, it, we've always been consistent, haven't changed it because we haven't needed to. And a lot of the, or like the original, if you look right in front of you, Tiffany, yeah. that white box, the ingredients. Okay, the ingredients are pork, water, salt, and spices. And that is it in this one right here. So that's the original, that that's the original recipe. And we, cr we recently got the paleo certification on that and the no sugar stamp on the front. Nice. It's never had sugar. Yeah. But now that that's a big thing and people are looking for that, we put that call out on the box so that they can see it without having to pick it up and always look at it. It says right on the front, no sugar. So Find it easier. And that's wonderful. why these are in the freezer section, right? Correct. All of the sausages, whether they're fully cooked or ready to cook, are going to be in the freezer section. Um, when we make them, the meat comes in fresh, we make the sausage, and then it's um, immediately flash frozen. Mm -hmm. So it's frozen one time. It goes to the store frozen, to your house frozen, and then you warm it when you eat it. So, um, you know, other companies sometimes are thawing and freezing and thawing and freezing, and every time you do that, you're compromising the quality of the meat. Right. So ours is one time frozen, and then you thaw it when you eat it. Well, you think about that even with like a vegetable or something, that sort of mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. flash frozen, that's when you get the best nutrients, the best ingredients, the freshest stuff. The freshness, stuff. exactly. So it really does make a difference in the way it tastes. Mm -hmm. And the other reason is because not only certified gluten-free, mm -hmm. but we also have no preservatives, no additives, no nitrates, no nitrites, no MSG, no fillers. So it has to be in the freezer section because yeah. if it was if it was thawed, the shelf life on it would only be a couple of days, which is a good thing. I love that. I want to talk about the different varieties mm -hmm. and why it tastes so good. But the, uh, some people are going to say, wait, I've seen this in the refrigerated section. Mm -hmm. They've seen Jones Dairy Farm products there, but they're different products than the, the sausage. So it's the things like the bacon, yeah. which is delicious. The Braunschweiger, um, the Canadian bacon, things like that are mm -hmm. going to be refrigerated. All of the sausages are always going to be frozen. All right, so talk about the yeah. variety. So we've got, like I said, the ready to eat and then the ready to cook. So the okay. pre-cooked are or fully cooked. Um, I've got some in here. We've got patties and links. Those it, are like your maple pork ones and mm -hmm. your turkey and your chicken. Yep. It, well, I have the, the poultry's in here. Okay. So this is chicken and turkey in here. This one is pork. We've got maple and Wait, the original. Point to that one we're seeing right in front. That was what? This is uh, chicken links. Okay, chicken. Turkey patties. Okay. And Super then healthy, lower fat. Lower fat. If you're looking for that, those are excellent options. And then over here, We've got the original links, mm, are those and then the maple pork or mm -hmm. just original. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah, those are so. So good. original and maple over here in this pan, and then this pan is the white box, which would oh, be the, the ready to cook. So that's raw when you get it. So you have to make sure you cook it to the right temperature. Okay. Which is you know it's it's just a matter of preference. If you prefer to cook from raw, which some people do, which was the only way they ever used to do it. Yeah. Then that's what you're used to, and these have a great snap on them. The casing. Oh, I want to try um, that one. The casing on the sausages, and you know we talk about. We talk about consistency. Mm -hmm. We'll see if these are done yet. If not, then I don't want you to okay. eat it, but we'll check them. All right. Uh, yep, we're Looks good. good. We're good. Um, we talk about the consistency on it. We have also been using the same, the, the lamb casings from the same farm in New Zealand for over 100 years. So that's incredible. not only the recipe is consistent, you know, and, and oh Philip, gosh, that's good. Philip always says, you know, if you didn't like it 100 years ago, you're not going to like it now because <laughs> it's the same recipe. It's never and changed. It tastes homemade. Yeah, it yeah, really it does. does. And the, the blend delicious. of spices. Are, are incredible. Go Perfect. to jonesdairyfarm.com for great recipes as well as a product locator to find a store closest to you with the products you're looking for. Thanks, mm. Kate. Thanks, Kate.